हेलो फ्रेंड्स इन दिस वीडियो विल टॉक अबाउट एक्सटेंडेड पीजन होल प्रिंसिपल विद एग्जांपल्स वेलकम बैक फ्रेंड्स लेट्स टॉक अबाउट एक्सटेंडेड पीजन होल प्रिंसिपल इन द लास्ट वीडियो वी डिस्कस पीजन होल प्रिंसिपल एंड इन दैट वीडियो वी डिस्कस द फॉर्मूला फॉर एक्सटेंडेड पीजन होल प्रिंसिपल सो वेन टू यूज पीजन होल वेन टू इज एक्सटेंडेड पीजन होल if there is a very small difference between number of pigeons and number of pigeon rows or 99% time you can say there is a difference of one 13 students 12 months 8 student uh, uh, 7 days so uh, there is a uh, difference of one then in that case you going to use pigeon hole if a difference is more between pigeon and pigeon holes then you going to go with extended pigeon hole principle now let us discuss the first problem extended pigeon hole principle if seven colors are used to paint 50 bicycles now see here there are seven colors and there are 50 bicycles see the difference the difference is more here n is equal to number of pigeons is 50 50 bicycles are there and seven colors are there so m is equal to 7 now you can see m is less than 7 that means there is a huge difference between these two therefore extended pigeon hole principle is applicable so what the extended pigeon hole principle says n minus 1 upon m plus 1 so at least one pigeon will contains these many pigeons so which is equal to according to this particular uh, question n is 50 so this is 50 minus 1 upon 7 so that is 14 plus 1 so this is 49 so 49 divided by 7 is 7 so 7 plus 1 is 8 so at least one pigeon hole contains eight pigeons so what is the question show that eight of them must have same color so eight of them are they have must the same color so therefore eight have same color so this is what extended pigeon hole principle is you just need to put the formula nothing else obviously there is a difference of one then also you can use the uh, formula then answer will always be 2 13 months 12 uh, stu uh, 13 students 12 months so at least uh, two students will have their birthday in the same month so the answer will be 2 now if difference is more we use extended pigeon hole principle formula let's talk about the next question if 30 dictionaries contain these many pages so pages means your pigeons and pigeon hole so these pages are into 30 dictionaries so m is equal to 30 i hope you are getting the difference of pigeon and pigeon holes right so what is the extended pigeon hole principle formula says so this is 61327 minus 1 upon m 30 so plus 1 obviously we forgot plus 1 here so that is plus 1 equal to plus 1 equal to Uh, if you and this is your floor function this is not a bracket that we discussed in the last video what do you mean by floor function if it is 49.9 all then also it will take 49 the lowest integer basically so if we solve this we going to get 2045 so that's it we verified show that if 30 dictionaries in a library contain a total of 61327 pages then one of the dictionaries must have 2045 pages so this is the result so one of the pigeon hole must contain at least n minus 1 upon m plus 1 pigeon so at least one of the dictionaries must contain 2045 pages so this is the uh, next example so in this problem you need to identify page, uh, what is pigeon and what is pigeon hole pigeons are assigned into pigeon holes so here 50 bicycles they are given seven colors so pigeons are bicycles and colors are pigeon holes pages are pigeons and uh, dictionaries are your pigeon hole let us uh, talk about the next problem problem number 3 how many friends must have to guarantee that how many friends must have to guarantee that at least 5 of them will have their birthday in the same month again month month means what m is equal to 12 and what is given in this problem the formula we know is n minus 1 upon m plus 1 is equal to at least whatever is the answer so it's already given how many friends must have to be guaranteed that at least 5 of them so this is given you need to understand the problem and how many friends that means in this problem n is unknown we need to find it out n see n is what pigeons friends are pigeons 
months are pigeon holes so how many friends are there that means in this problem we need to find it out n generally student don't understand what is n and what is m if you can't understand that you cannot go ahead further so you need to understand this right so how many friends must have to guarantee that so n is the question mark at least five of them will have their birthday in the same month so if you simplify this equation so this will be n minus 1 upon m m is 12 plus 1 is equal to 5 so this one will go to that side will become 4 so in short this is what n minus 1 upon 12 is equal to 4 what next this 12 will go to that side will become 48 and this floor function is gone now because this 12 because of this divided by 12 it's a floor function that means we need to take the uh, lowest integer but since we are taking a 12 to that side there is no div uh, divisor so no need to take floor so n minus 1 is equal to 48 n is equal to 49 so how many friends are needed 49 so if there are 49 friends we can uh, assure that or we can say that at least five of them will have their birthday on the same month next question now you read the problem and tell me what is given in the problem n given m given what given what asked please read what is the minimum number of students required did you understand yes n is question mark minimum number of students see the number of students bicycles all are pigeons basically pages number of students required in a class to be sure that at least six will receive the same grade so at least six will receive the same grade question is incomplete there are five grades question is incomplete now the question is completed so what is the minimum number of students required to ensure that at least six will get the same grade if there are five grades so five will come here five is your pigeon holes so grades are given to students so if you simplify so that this will go to that side five five will be multiplied obviously this floor function will be gone so n is equal to 26 so 26 students are needed to ensure that at least six will receive the same grade and there are five grades that's it so this is the way how we're going to implement extended pigeonhole principle hope you understood we're done with the video thank you for watching this video take care